Hi guys, it's the Purple Berry Girl here, and I just wanted to show you all my hammer bead creations, or otherwise known as perler bead creations. So first, um, well actually right now, I'm well I just made a tutorial on how to make these Oreo cookies, so I still need to edit it, so it's probably going to be up in the next couple of days. So first is the Oreo cookies. They're just a sandwich cookies, I think they're called. I, I don't like Oreo cookies. I just don't like them. They're not very nice. So basically just do... It's just little discs and I glue them together. And if you're wondering where I got this dish, it's from an ice cream, HB ice cream. I forget what it's called, but it's the lid to it. It's like this little pot. And it's got it's just plain ice cream with a little whip. And then it's got pink and green stuff like in inside it. I sauce sauce anyways that's the lid to it so i was eating one of those and i was just thinking hey i'll make a cute little lid so there you go and i also made this tiny little wrap seat sweet so technically it's not a hammer bead creation but i just thought it was kind of cute so it's just cardboard with tin foil cell tape glue and a tiny little hammer bead for decoration not that secure but it's cute so i've got little watermelon slices for the girls Nothing really much to say there. I've got a Game Boy. I'm a bit of a nerd, so I love the Game Boys. They're so cool. I also love Pokemon. So this is Kits, since she's the geek in the family. And she likes Pokemon, obviously. She's kind of based on me, even though, like, I didn't live in her era, obviously. <laughs> but this is a ham slice and a cheese slice. I'm planning on making some bread for them out of some kind of material. I don't know what material yet. So I'm planning to make some bread. And these are going to be the fillings. Next is... Da -da -da -da! So technically this isn't for the girls since it's actually the size of their head. Like, there is my hand. There it is. So it's the size of my palm. But I just thought it was so cute. I had to show you guys. It's this little sushi. Kwai, kwai sushi made out of hammer beads. I just made it today and kwai means cute in Japanese so I just thought it was so cute. I found it on the internet and google images so I don't know who it's from but just search up hammer bead creations or inspiration or whatever and you should be able to find it. Or look up like hammer beads and um, what's it called or perler beads. Yeah perler beads like sushi or something so it's super cute and last but not least is this it's better from this kind of view. And there we go. So basically, I took my hamster cage, which originally was a hamster cage. And now it's a tortoise cage. So I just thought that was so cute. I made this tiny little tortoise. Found that on Google Images. Don't know who it's from. Whoever it is from. And if you know them, or if that is you, thank you. And I'm sorry I didn't mention your name. Because I, obviously, as I said, I don't know you. But thank you. Because this tortoise is just so cute. So basically, it was done in blue by the person, but I did it in green. Just to kind of go with the overall theme. I think it's cuter in blue, but I didn't have the blue, so... Yeah. So instead of a hamster cage, it's now a tortoise cage. So that's super cute. And obviously, I do know that tortoises do not use hamster wheels, but I'm just going to leave it in. So basically that's all my hammer bead creations, but wait, I have super exciting news. Two little news flashes for you. So let me just put you up here. Do, 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 do. Do. So you're right now is looking at two massive boxes. So basically I'm planning to create these into a dollhouse for my girls. I'm really excited about this, but unfortunately they keep sitting in this right now because they can't stand upright. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut off this piece and the top piece. And they're going to be side by side. So right now I'm just thinking about where to put it so it won't be done. They like won't be finished in a while but I'm going to be making you know, little wallpapers and windows for them. So basically the upstairs of this, I guess this room here is going to be the bedroom. The other room is on the bottom, the one I have on the bottom here. Is just gonna be a living room and a kitchen area. So there it is. It's really dark in there, so I don't see know if you can actually see inside it. But I, 
I just can't wait. So, there you go. Here's Kit. I'm just going to take her out because I've got another piece of news. So, basically, my other piece of news. Sorry. Hang on a minute, guys. <laughs> there we go. So, my other piece of news is... Dun, 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 dun. I'm super excited for this. I just ordered some cute antique glasses. Doll glasses, of course. For Kit. So basically, I always thought she'd look really cute for the past while with some cute little vintage glasses. And I've been looking out for some on eBay and Etsy. If you do not, if you do not know what Etsy is, please check it out. It's kind of like this. It's eBay, but it's for crafters. And you can look up American Girl stuff and they will be stuff there. Unfortunately, most of them tend to ship to America. So if you're not in America... Yeah, you're going to have to do a bit more searching like I have to. But if you are in America, you've got a massive heaven to shop in. So, basically, I've just ordered some cute little glasses. They're like, well, I'm going to keep them a secret. So they'll be a nice surprise. But obviously, I'm super excited. And the person who I got it from, I forget their name. And I, pro I probably won't mention them, just in case they might not like me mentioning them or something. I don't know. Um, but I got them off Etsy, and I got them for around nine, eight dollars. Yeah, I think that's what it was. And it'll take about a week to come out here. Three days to ship, and uh, probably a week to be actually arriving. So she's just going to hang out and wait a week for her eye problems. But luckily, I finally found some classes for her. I was really looking forward to this now. So I'm going to be counting down the days. So anyways, please rate, comment, like and subscribe. See you.